Oh guys, it's a dude who fills his telly with a toaster. Um, okay, customised blocks with animations. That's the new patch. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, looking on the feedback on the forums and that, uh, most people are loving it. Um, there's a few people saying it's a waste of time. So for them people, your lips, my backside, they should set up a meeting sometime. Um, now I'm going to do an in-depth tutorial again going through every command for each animation for you uh, so it might be a bit long and you might get a bit gum flapping going on but bear with it you'll get all the commands and I'll give you some examples of how they work so let's start off now this one you're looking at now is dervish so you can get funky effects with dervish Okay, well, let's get to the workshop and we'll show you some uh, hints and tips on what to do. Now you've got your dervish. Right, first thing you're going to need um, is either a cheap USB keyboard, you can pick them up for next and out, okay, or a Microsoft chat pad. Okay, now then. Once you've got them, you'll be able to type in your commands. So, the first thing you need to realize is, when you name your custom block, you've built your custom block, it's in your workshop, right? As long as that custom block is in the workshop like that, doesn't matter where you are, so we'll leave it in the workshop, and we'll bugger off over here, right? So there you go, custom blocks over there, custom blocks in the workshop, I can name that, anything I want anywhere on the world okay so we'll do our name in here now then animations so you press your shift button on your keyboard or your chat pad right now it's set name as you can see on the screen set name space and then you put your title of your of your animation okay so if you watch the command prompt I'm going to run through each one and then I'll give you examples so you know. Okay, so we've got Twizzle. Alright. We've got Grow Shrink. We've got Small. We've got Big. That's a cock up. We've got Jiggle. We've got wind, too much curry. We've got dangle. We've got randomize facing. And we've got another cock up. We've got dervish. We've got squish. Piston. Planetary. Orbit. Green smoke. Smoke. Fire, fountain, rotate clockwise, that rotate CW, and normal rotate. And have we done jiggle? Well, let's jiggle again. Okay, so that's all, that's every command that I know of anyway. Okay, so that's what you can do. So I want to show you some examples of what they are and a, and a couple of little, little funkies there. Right, so get that off now the first thing is jiggle I believe um, remember the tank so I've got the rotate All right got your tracks now I've got the ground set with jiggle so it's going over a bridge and everything's moving so that's your jiggle All right and we've got my dervish which is your stuff getting kicked out the back Okay, so that's your animations working together. That's not too bad. Um, piston speaks for itself. You've seen piston. Basically, remember the clipping goes through. So, choose that. Delete it. So, there you go. You've got a block. You would normally lay another block there. Stick your piston in. And that shoots up like that. Okay, dead easy. Now then. That's rotate. Now notice, rotate goes counterclockwise. Okay, 
So if you want something to go clockwise, it's rotate CW. Now the reason you need that is so you can blend that one with orbit. That's orbit. Okay. Now orbit goes clockwise, so your rotate must go clockwise. Now to make this, um, obviously it's got to be two blocks, so they've got to look like they're meeting. Okay. So you build in the workshop so basically that's the floor your workshop and you build your wheel from floor to ceiling okay floor to ceiling and then your blade okay you build your blade what a cock up keep forgetting there you go you build your blade is a separate block on the floor right so when that's put on top of that which I'll show you on here so there you go so when you put them on top you get a blade and basically the only noticeable thing is you've got that little step there okay but when you're looking at the front it just looks like one moving part okay so that's orbit and that's rotate clockwise okay and that's what you can do with that so think about the other funky stuff you can do um now then planetary so i've got my dervish in the middle and then i've got my orbit and planets around there Okay, so uh, you guys are like these space scenes and things like that. Or if you want to do, I don't know, some funky scientific Frankenstein y gothic y stuff, you can get some good stuff with that. So I'll take these off. If I can remember where I put them. Right, so we'll just stick it on there. So that's your planetary. Now notice the blocks in the middle, so it rotates around its own block, right? So the next one, we'll stick it on top. And then we can stick one. If I can find the block, bloody hell. It's probably easier to lay your blocks and then get them moving. Because they're buggers to find. There you go. That's your planetary. So you can do some funky stuff mixed with a bit of orbit and a bit of rotate and you could probably just about build a small solar system looking thing okay now then i'll show you some other examples um in my other builds on my chains got them on twizzle as well so there's movement And we'll go down here. Let's rotate. Here you've got your movement. I ran out of blocks, so I, I couldn't make a proper conveyor. Um, but that's nine enough for pit walk. There you go. You've got your movement there. Which I rotate. There's a bit of rotate and fire and twizzle in the old craneage. Now this one, I've gone for a bit of twizzle and a bit of dangle. All right, that's the effect you're getting with that. Bit of twizzle and a little bit of dangle. All right, get up close and have a gander. Got my twizzle on my vine. We've got my dangle. Use these on the trees, apples. There you go. Remember the owl apple trees? We've got a bit of danglage going on, so it's a bit of movement. So the world's not static now. We've got movement. And uh, over here, we've got some, some nice wind your wind that you watch that for a bit 
It's quite calming. I like the wind. Not the farting wind, the wind in the game wind. And get up here. I'll show you this one. This is basically randomized facing, bit of windage, and a bit of twizzle. So basically, you've got the whole place moving. It's no longer static when you're walking around. Now we've got uh, green smoke. And grow shrink. That's your green smoke. And this is your grow shrink. Once again, got some good funkies going on. For you guys who like to play with the mines a bit. Alright, I'll show you a couple of more effects you can get with a grow shrink as well. This one I particularly like. This is grow shrink over Easter eggs. Now, unfortunately, you can't get Easter eggs anymore, but if you do have Easter eggs in your world, um, another shout out for clean rook um, stick some grow shrink blocks over the top and if you get them right you've got your you've got your runway light so your strobe lighting okay let's just have a quick scoot show you exactly how it's working so I've got my grow shrink which basically in Easter eggs at the bottom Okay, and that's giving you the a nice funky effect. Hope you enjoy that one. Um, play out August to get the Easter eggs back in, so we can have some more fun or something similar, something that glows. Um, but for you guys who haven't got Easter eggs in the world, here's another one for you. This is the wizard's tower as I imagined it. Um, the lights were a bit static when I first did them, but that's all I had to work with. Um, but this is the sort of effect I wanted. Um, so you can see this basically really effective that. And that's basically just grow shrink done in a, a circle around um and you've got your custom lights behind it to make it glow obviously there we'll have it and we'll get some good basically good effects going on now you notice this build is running very smoothly very smoothly indeed thank Arcus for that one as well um obviously the last build your old xbox was panting like a fat lass at a disco and now it's nice and smooth it's taking it well it's brilliant um a bit more grow shrink i've added it to the old lighthouse so you got a nice sort of flickering effect on the lights okay now let's have a look so, at something else. This is me, as you can see, my little little garden flowers. Okay. So, as you can see, flowers all set up, all look the same. It's all boring and, you know, everything's exactly the same. They're all facing the same way. Okay, so what you can do with that is a good little command called randomize facing. There we go. So, randomized facing. Now, as you can see, <clears throat> all your blocks are facing a different way. So, it gives that a little bit of a 
extra effect for you so it's not all looking the same in all it's all nice and random okay. right I can see the old skeleton it's giving it some twisty turny okay so that is what you call twizzle all right. now then on the forums I've seen a, um, a map being built called Atlantis and uh, I think it needs jellyfish so there you go squish we've got jellyfish okay guys right. this is my spawn and I've got lots of particle effects going on here okay so gold chain that's been set up with fountain so as you can see if you get a distance you get a bit of a bling effect going on so you don't have to just use them for what you would normally use them for you can basically do what you want go for the effects so I've gone for bling all right and we've obviously got the fire coming out of this all right I've got my green smoke okay that's your green smoke there and we've got dervish dervish some really good effects with that so you guys have got the eyes for it um shout out for clean rook this guy's got an imagination like you wouldn't believe um i bet you could have fun with that stuff okay such so a dervish now we have a bit bling about the uh, fountain and fire so guys I hope that was informative um, and I hope I covered everything for you and uh, obviously any questions Get yourselves on the forums, um, Projector Games website, uh, Arcos is doing the uh, video logs for you, and um, get yourself on the Facebook as well. Okay guys, keep smiling now.